Hi to everyone. Today's topic is going to cover scenery remove objects zone. Uh, and here I am at Batumi. And as you can see, I've got a building in front of me with a few trees. What I want to do is I want to extend the aircraft parking using the AV8B and a hangar. And I'm going to put uh, a hangar and AV8B where that building and those trees are. So let me show you how to do that. Right, back in the mission editor, and the first step is to create a zone. Um, that's very simple, like I did in the previous video. Click on the site, and I'll call the trigger Remove. And what I want to do is remove all those items, so I want the trees and the buildings gone. I'm going to size it down to around about 40, and I'm going to leave it as the same colour. So that's the Remove zone created. Right, now we need to set the rules for the trigger to remove those items. So let's go to Set Rules for Trigger. I'll create a new one and call it um, Remove 1. We'll do it after 10 seconds, which is just purely for the uh, video purposes. Normally I would do it at mission start, so that I had a, a takeoff point. But we'll go time more than 10 seconds. What I want to now select is remo uh, scenery removal. So, scenery remove object zone. Select that. The zone that I want to remove it from is remove. And I want to remove all the items. If you go into this drop down box, you'll see that you can do all items, trees only, or objects only. Now, bear in mind, um, this is a new addition to DCS World and the Mission Editor. Uh, so it can be a little bit buggy in places. Sometimes the trees will be removed, sometimes they won't. Sometimes the objects will be removed, sometimes they won't. Just depends where on the Caucasus map. Seems to work very well in the Persian Gulf. But what I want to do is I want all of the items to be removed from that area. And that is the trigger conditions all set up. Here we are in the mission, and those buildings and trees should disappear very shortly. There we go. So that's that sorted. What I'll do is I'll go back into the mission editor, make it so that it does it from the start of the mission, and I'll put an aircraft hangar and aircraft in that slot. So I've extended the parking slots at Batumi. Okay, so I've changed the type to for mission start, so that, that scenery will be removed at the start of the mission. That's all I've changed in the triggers and actions. What I've also done is I've placed a hangar, which is a mod, in that location, and I've also placed an AV8B. Take her from the ground with these engines off. And that's basically all I've done, so let's go back into the mission and I'll show you how that worked. Back in the mission at Batumi. And there are the uh, buildings removed and the trees removed, the hangar inserted, uh, and a coal star AV8B. So that's the simple process, that's how it works. I hope you found this very useful, and thanks for watching. Bye now.